Is this acorn squash too yellow to cook? <laughs> Let's find out. First, we're going to cut this thing directly in half. It doesn't look bad. It's a bit dry looking. And now I'm just going to scoop these seeds out and I'm going to save them to the side and of course I'm going to plant them for more. And while I'm doing that I got the oven preheated to 375. And this is how we want them to look. Nice and clean. Now we're going to take the knife, we're just going to kind of score the insides in a crisscross motion, okay? So it looks something like that. What I have here now is some butter, very soft. And we're going to rub this around all on the inside and on the edges, okay? And this is how it should look. Nice and done. I have a pan here, all set up. Now I want to make this sweet. You can go with savory as well and add different herbs and chives and salt and pepper and things, but it's breakfast time, so I'm kind of, you know, just want to get this nice and sweet. Not over sweet. You can also put raisins in here. I am going to add some cinnamon. Now ideally, you may want to add some brown sugar, but I'm just going to add a little pancake syrup. Trust me, this will work. And of course, in the great outdoors, it's a little bit of cinnamon, not much. Forever free. Let's put a little water into the bottom. You and me, meant to be. All right, looking good. In the great now outdoors, into the oven. About 45 minutes, and we should be good. Now we play the waiting game. As far as these go, uh, the chickens will absolutely love this. Anything to do with seeds and pumpkin innards or whatever, they would love it. But you know me, I'm a seed saver. So I'm going to go ahead and germinate a couple of these and get them into the garden. <sighs> Looks good. It smells like pancakes. It really does. Now we're going to stick a fork in it. You should be able to pierce the skin. Let's see. Oh, that goes right through there. All right. I'm going to give it about 10 more minutes, OK? Let's see. actually tastes uh, very good so uh, the obvious question is was this old acorn squash too yellow to cook absolutely not with that being said I advise you to give it a try give us a thumbs up is this something that you would try are you gonna try it let us know and as always peace I'm going to start with a And don't forget, please subscribe or just hit the like button. It helps us out a lot. And as always, peace from the Garden of Fiodora.